Thank you so much for tuning in on this Wednesday in Chicago. I'm Jeff Herndon. Dawn is on assignment at the White House tonight. We have breaking news across the city and suburbs right now. Let's get to it with Lisa Chavaria. Jeff, we are live here at Chicago Police District 11, where investigators are taking a look at a Facebook Live video showing a group of people holding a young man hostage. Chicago Police tell us four people are in custody tonight, and we must warn you, the video we are about to show you may be considered graphic. What? Big <laughs> Donald Trump. <laughs> Five people. What? No. <laughs> Goof. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> my sister took up with yeah, time, nigga, dude. Thing in this life, huh? Oh, man. <laughs> like my sister said, this is not funny, y'all. You know, it's funny to me. Chicago police were made aware of this video yesterday afternoon. A young African American woman streamed the video live on Facebook, showing at least four people holding a young white man hostage. He is repeatedly kicked and hit. His scalp is cut, all while he is tied up with his mouth taped shut. Community activist Andrew Holmes was made aware of this disturbing video. When I seen it, I just wanted to make sure this guy was safe. But it's a hate crime, and you know they humili humiliated him and. It's uncalled for, so now we have to let the chips fall where they lay. We are told that young man you saw who was tied up in the corner is now recovering at an undisclosed hospital. We have reached out to Chicago police. They tell us so far no charges have been filed, but again, four people are in custody tonight. Reporting live in the Lawndale neighborhood, Lisa Chavaria, Fox 32 News.